hi guys welcome to another beautiful episode side hustle with happy okay we are with discuss charts you know ways of making money online in side hustle but today guys we'll be talking about the popular ai the trending chat boards the trending chat engine especially for those that are into write-ups you know uh amazon and all the rest of them people are using this ai to make money online some platforms and um some websites are equally paying people you know especially those that write stories and their books are using it very well and they are being paid those that have to write two thousand words one thousand words you get they are using it and they are making money out of it and please the guys do subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed to subscribe if you're a returning subscriber thank you i appreciate all right so the site i'm talking about is chat gpt yes it is chat gpt so guys right now i'll be taking you guys right now guys i'll be putting you guys through on how to register it log in and how to use it how to type whatever you want to type and you get your result if you want the chat gp to write story for you it will write it all right or for you very easy okay so without wasting much of your time guys let's move over so you see what it's all about let's go first thing let's see what um google got to say about chat gpt right so you go to your google you type in chat gpt then you search Let's see what it got to say first, then we can proceed, okay? Remember, if you have not subscribed, please do subscribe. Now, look at what it says. Wikipedia says chat GPT is an artificial intelligence, intelligence chat bots developed by open ai and released in november 2022 the name chat gpt combines see let's go down and see more let's just go down and see more you can pause to read okay you can pause the video to get the definitions from Google before we proceed. Now, for you to sign in to Chat GTP, all right, you go back to your search, you go back, right, you type in, you type in Open AI. Open AI, that is what you type for you to log in or register to Chat GTP. And when you log in, it opens. You click on introducing Chat GPT. This is what it gives you. You see in this green interface? Yeah, let's go. That is what it gave you. Then you go back up, click sign up. If you have not signed up before, you click sign up. But if you have registered or signed up before, you click login, right? So once you click sign up, it brings you to this page where you key in your email and password. The password you want to use for the, the chat GP. You key in your email and your password. You click continue. Now you'll be asked to verify your email, meaning an email has been sent to your email address. So what we need to do right now is go to the email address and check. All right, let's get check the mail they sent. Let's go. Let's go to the email address. You can see that's my email address. Now that is the mail they sent to me. You see it verify. I'm asked to verify. 
all right then i'll click on verify email once i click on verify email it takes me to the setup page where they need more details you know you key in your first name last name organizational name that is optional if you have then your date of birth then you click continue now your name first name last name and your date of birth are the most important the organization is optional so if you don't want to put that you can let it go but if you have organizational name you can equally add it is optional not compulsory but the first name and last name and date of birth is compulsory then you click on next and once you click on next you'll be asked to key in your phone number depending on the country you are whichever country just i'm in nigeria so nigeria is showing so you key in your phone number the phone number your phone number should be accessible so once you key in your phone number you will be given a person now this person is just to test you okay just a normal test it's very easy it's not that hard all right then you click on the puzzle to solve the puzzle usually some at times one or two puzzles one or two puzzles to solve that is what they give they don't give much so when you click on the puzzle to solve them they'll bring out the puzzle for you so you click on the puzzle yeah now you can see the hand to the left hand side and the right hand side the left hand side is the direction where they want me to put to direct the right hand side the right hand so that should be a lion you know, or there about okay then make sure it's facing the direction the hand is pointing okay completed now a code once you're done with the puzzle a code will be sent to the your phone number to verify it is your phone number now a code will be sent to your phone number click on check your mobile phone get the code then you key it in that is what they need by enter code once you key in the code this is what you see that means you've been successful yeah that means you'll be successful now you can just scroll around whatever you know but if not you just go to the right hand side click on personal then click on chat gpt up there yeah once you click on it it will bring you here now you have done your registration you have signed up it's time to sign in are you getting me it is time to sign in you have signed up it's time to sign in they click on sign in you put in your email and your password the email you use in opening the chat you click it once you key it in the openings all right it's just an introduction trying to explain to you what chat gtb is now look at this interface this is um examples of what you can do with chat gp right you can delimitations too they are there they're trying to be plain now for you to ask chat gp for anything you can see chats the other side or you can come down where you the where there is a new message and type in whatever you want to ask right let's say for example let me ask how how to bake cake how do i bake cake not bad how to bake cake here yeah. let's see what they will give to us wow you see it lots of lots of lots of 
Now this write up, I think it should be more than 200, 200 words. Yeah. Now, if you have any specific uh, number of words you want, key it in. Like if I want that, uh, how to bake cake to be like 500 words, I'll say how to bake cake in 500 words or whatever. But if you have a particular number of words you want the chat GP to give you, you specify when asking the questions. So that is it. So let's type an order. Mm. Let's see what it gives us. This is so good. You see, it started with ingredients, listed it, the quantity, everything. Then down there we have the directions on how to go about it, which is very easy. You can easily just copy this, you know print it out, share it, give it out, or use it in yourself, you know, to practice. So let's try another one. Um, I think children, children, a notebook or princess or something should do. Let's see what they give us. Let's see what they give us. For those that like story for kids and all the rest. Let's see. Let's see, let's see. Okay, let's wait. That is it. Mm -hmm. Our princess's story is ready. Wow. Now you can do some adjustments. You can adjust it. You copy it, paste it on your note or your Microsoft and uh, you adjust it. You can change some words and all the rest. That is it. And we have asked two questions and they gave it to us. You read it through. If you want to change whatever, the name, whatever. That would be cool. Then, I think we should ask another question. Let's ask another question and see what it gives us. Um, how to do a light makeup? Okay, let's go with makeup. Let's see the direction. Let's see that. Uh -huh. Yeah, that is it. Now you have been given the ways. Anyone that is optional to step. Yeah, that is it. So that is how to do your makeup, you see? Now for a novice, you can easily read through this, okay? And you get to know how to do your makeup. It's very easy. That is what ChatGP does. It helps in write up stories, um, cooking books, um, skin routine care, and so many write ups. Anything that got to do with write ups, that is what G ChatGTP does. Okay, what you can do is just copy it. If anyone you ask and you're okay, you copy it. If there's adjustment, you can just redirect the question in one way or the other. All right. Copy it, paste it in your Microsoft Word, edit it, and do some adjustment and all the rest. Okay, that is it. It makes it very easy. It helps even in the typing. You don't need to type. You just copy do some adjustment and that is it you're good to go yeah you copy everything very the, the explanation alone is very much okay very much okay so that is how you use your chat gtb your chat gpt sorry guys 
guys please if you have not subscribed please do subscribe so so when next i post a video you'll be notified immediately